Opera is your life sung back at you. So when, a, when an audience goes to, to see a production, they're going not only to hear the music and to hear the singing, but to get the message of that music and the singing. The preacher, to make me repeat. I think the enduring appeal of Susanna and why it's such a popular American opera, probably the most often performed, is a combination of the fact that the music is extremely accessible and with lots of beautiful melodies that are memorable. The story is very compelling and is timeless. It's a beautiful story, it's a touching story, it's moving and it's a story that needs to be told, but it's not an easy story. Susanna Polk is my dream role, mostly because she's such a dynamic character. You see her go from this innocent young woman to being betrayed by her entire community and the demise of her. And it's an actor's dream to be able to show all of that in one performance. The roles of Susanna and Blitch require some heroic singing. It's lyric, but it's also dramatic. And so you need voices with power and cut. And we happen to have those kind of voices right now. It's been uh, really exciting to uh, explore uh, the Reverend Olin Blitch. It's really easy to just see him as this caricature, this angry, yelling preacher who is against sin and fire and brimstone and all that. But you really have to dig in deeper uh, and find the humanity in him. I just wanted to jump on the chance for us at Northwestern to tell this particular story. When the show was written, it was basically a response to the McCarthyism. It, it was premiered in, at University of Florida State in 1955 and then at New York City Opera in 1956. And so the, the whole idea of mob mentality and name calling was very much on, still on the American public's mind. In the revival scene, uh, we see the congregation sort of evolve into this huge, throbbing energy that is against Susanna. It's electrifying, I think, to see this, this scene which starts in the church where everybody begins you know, more altruistically and then becomes less and less tolerant and more threatening. And the, the sort of excitement and the passion and the fear in a revival meeting. Operas are about something. There's a message, and Susanna has a message. And the message is, when you come too quick to judge people without really having the facts and really knowing what you're doing and you just do it based on, on prejudice and hunch, you can do a lot of damage.